Greetings, Soulswind here, and welcome to Let's Play Cooking Simulator Shelter. In the last episode, we helped Dr. James Mill with reducing the radiation level to below 12, and we served a lot of the same dish. That was really fun. <laughs> we saved a lot of money too, from all those dishes. In this episode, we need to help him reduce the rat population to 5, and at the same time, cook up something to support his investigation team. So that's what we're going to do. And because I forgot to end the episode, we'll continue where I left off. Let's start with the stroganoff. We want to check if there's like the stroganoff, all right? Stroganoff, stroganoff. Yeah, we can accept that next time. The stroganoff one. Why do we have the gun with us here? We brought this down. Anyways, it's okay. We need to reduce the rat population. It's 10 now. Aiming, aiming. Oh my goodness. Rats were running away from here. Got another one. So that's already 8. We need to be faster. No armadillos for now, please. No time to scare off the rest. Anything from that side? Ah, Sorry for moving the mouse like that. The mouse? <laughs> no, we want the rat. Three. Two more to go. Two, five, right? Five. Seven. Ah, vultures. We'll take a voucher. That's already taken out. This is gonna take us some time. One more to go. One more to go. Oh, we just need one dish, right? Minimum three stars. Is that it? Dish requirements, just one only, if I'm not mistaken. Wait, hang on. Any vultures? I don't think we should take out any, though. Mutated rat 5. Okay. Already satisfied. So, put this back here. Not too much time spent there. How many dishes do we have to serve? Only one, isn't it? Just one. So, vegetarian dish and then one... That's like from the military base. Is this from the military base? Nope. Military base. It has to be vegetarian. Oh, wait. No, this is great. We can just make this twice. Uh, that's a lot to do. Did we buy enough water? Okay, we'll empty this away. Don't need it. Oh, white beans. Ah, yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah. White beans, of course. Do we even have a sink? No. No. Can we get from here? Can we refill the bottle? Hey, we can. We can get from here. Okay, it's one. So, can we refill the bottle? I don't know. I discarded it. You know what? We can find out. Harvest these first. Yay! Did we get the achievement? No. We planted everything. Hang on. This is like here. Can we put it in here? No, I don't think we can open bottle. Okay. Can we refill this? Does it help? Doesn't help. Close bottle. Okay. So be it. White beans 250. White beans 250. From here. From here. 
Ah, okay. Sure. <laughs> Put it like that. No problem at all. And then find it not possible to remove. Ah, it is. Okay. Great. Two hundred? Wait, what? Oh, two fifty. Okay, one can. One can. Awesome. The direction in which it's pouring is really awkward. Onion, leek, and garlic. Garlic halves, 10 grams. Into here. Let's see. The 4 grams one. So, 6 goes in here. The other one takes everything. And then we just leave it here. No, put it back here. Now for this, we'll take onion and leek. Leek. Quarters, huh? And then onion. Quarters. Yeah, I think we should be fine. So we'll cut this in half through the middle. And then have like this. Usually this gives the best quarter cuts. Yeah, look at this. Except for the 44. Everything else is really good. But everything else is above 50. So that one is 44. But that's totally acceptable. Forty-five, fifty-three, forty-six, fifty-six. Okay, decent enough. Did we lose one knife? Oh, okay, no. Now, onion is going to be a problem. <laughs> Hang on, this one first. Okay. Boil for 60 seconds and then add the uh, garlic. How nice. How nice. Oh my goodness. I was trying to scroll my mouse wheel and then that happened. Sixty seconds. Sure. Okay, okay. 60 seconds and then 60 seconds nearer one pick up all of these okay now it's safe to cut the onions on this side Because we'll need to turn the knife this way. And it would have affected the leak. Ha, huh, okay. Pretty decent, I think. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Really, not bad. Okay. Awesome. Then fry 20 seconds. This one. Ah, okay. How nice. How nice. Uh oh. Thank you. Yeah, leave it open. Sure. Rapeseed oil. Here.
Okay, leave it here first. Three and four. Twenty-one, twenty-one. Yeah. Garlic and leek. Garlic and leek. This is 20 seconds, right? No, 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 no. Too risky. Okay, space that out like that. Thirty, and then at twenty-five, switch that on. So this will be at ten. Okay, and then this one is not going on, really. I switch this off, and this one. Stop to? Okay, I mean like, sure. Let's see. Uh, you have five more seconds. Very strange indeed. Okay. How about change the stove? Yeah. Okay, there, five. Yeah, that should be it. No, of course, click on the clock face and then pick up what's behind. Huh, they have the same progression. So this one I'll give you another 5 seconds, how about that? Okay, there. Is that better? That's so strange, why? They shouldn't have the same progression though. You know what, let's give it a try again. This is here, and this is here. Alright, 30 seconds each. Oh no, and then cut potatoes and whatnot? Are you serious? Are you serious? And then add to a new pot, really? Luckily we have two, so that's good. Put these behind over here. Okay, this order of cooking is wrong. 30 seconds each, right? So let's see. If we were to do this 30 seconds, does it do anything? Nope, it's spoiled. It's ruined. Put that in there. 30. Thirty. And then, potatoes and carrots. Okay, that's not that difficult. Two potatoes, two carrots, and then passata, celery root. Okay. That's fine, that's slightly overcooked. Slightly overcooked again, I think it's because of the extra time. Or the lack of time, I'm not too sure anymore because apparently they had the same progression and that's not right. They had the same progression even though one was switched off earlier than the other. Potatoes to carrots to. Yeah, I can review that on the recording. Fifteen. 
50 grams. Now, the rest are going to be cold, though. Okay. Add to a new pot, Pisata 1000, and then Celery Root. Ah, okay. Okay. This is not going to work here, so... We'll need to keep this one here, and then add this one to here. Passata. Get new Passata. Just hope that we have enough. Passata is like over here. No, one of these liquid is Passata. Whoa, really? Where is the Passata? Am I missing something? <laughs> wow, okay. Where's. Oh, oh, it's here. Alright. Don't topple it though. 1000 ml, that's one bottle. Was it from here? Did I pick it up from here? Passata, wait, hang on, I was, I saw it though, where was it? Passata, Passata, Passata. Wait, I, I just saw it, I literally just picked one. Oh, okay, it's here. <laughs> I don't know why I just forgot suddenly. Okay, it's fine. Okay. Celery root, 400. And then we'll just get one more for the other one. Yeah. No point wasting time. Give this one to you. And then you can take the carrots and the potatoes. Potatoes go here to facilitate cutting. We should be fine though, we should have a lot of time. Uh, no. Into quarters, yeah, okay. Quarters. Yeah, there it is, quarters. Yeah, quarters. Are these good? Oh, very good. How about these? Oh, not bad too. Nice. Carrots and potatoes. 50 grams. And then this one. And then boil for 120. Start this one that's outside. Two minutes. Okay, it's going. Now take the one that's inside, which is a wrong decision altogether. <laughs> it should be the inner one first, followed by the outer one. So in that case, we better use this one. Yeah. There we go. So what do we need to serve? Potato leek, white beans. Ah. Oh. Oh, okay. I see. I was like, wait, what about the one that we boiled? That's a white beans. This one, the leek. Haha. <laughs> interesting. Very interesting. So this one will be the white beans. How many white beans? 75 grams. Okay. Hang on, leek is 50 grams, right? Okay. And then potatoes? 37. Ah, okay. Celery roots not even needed. Interesting, very interesting indeed. We can just take from one. Nine seconds. Nope. Three. Switch that off. A leek. And one potato. We should have enough time, right? The soup is from here, I believe. 
Yeah, this is a soup. Okay. Uh oh. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. That's real bad. Why is it telling us that? Okay, let's see. I think it's fine. We have time. We definitely have time. Assign the dish requirements and everything. Five stars, definitely. This is good enough. This is too cold. Can't help it. Can't help it. This is here. Potato will take one. Yeah, just one potato will do. And then serve this. Oh my goodness. Okay. One. Two. One by one. One by one. Slowly. Don't panic. Assign dish. Does not meet requirements. Vegetarian dish. Because of the broth. Is that it? Like, this is vegetarian pea soup. Okay, now you see what's wrong with the game? You see, you see what's wrong with this game? See? Vegetarian dish. It says vegetarian pea soup. And then it says, no, you can't do this. Uh, it doesn't meet requirements, vegetarian dish, you can see here. Yeah. Yeah. You saw what's wrong with this now? That's ridiculous. Wait, hang on. Okay, it doesn't fit the requirements. We better not serve it like that. We just have to assign it to a normal one. Don't assign that to the special one. That's how ridiculous it is, you know? Like, why is this even happening? How can it even happen? Okay, it's just a water, so we'll discard this and put that inside there. That's an extra, so put that in here. Get the leek. Get the potatoes. There should still be potatoes. There's like four in here. We only took two. Okay. We should still have enough time. That's all the soup over here. Yeah, that's all the soup. Okay. Next. No more soup here. 100 ml though. That's still quite decent. You know what? Take out everything first. Easier. Yeah, just take out everything, discard that, put that there, have another plate. Much easier to handle. Potato, yeah. Struggle to get that. 100 ml from here. That's wonderful. And then we'll need 50 from this one. Put this back here. No, put it back here. And then another 150 from here. There we go. Okay. Okay. Time? Still have time. Awesome. No more potatoes, so, uh, yeah. Potato, leek, and white beans. Okay, so this can be emptied and put here. And then bring this out. There's no more leek here, so this can go too. And then place here for a convenient topple. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's how it works, huh? This is a deep plate, so why not? Take the leak, take this one. And then take the... Where is... Whoa! Did it fall through again?
Oh my gosh. Wait, I placed it here, right? I placed it here, right? I'm very certain I placed it here. I'll need to review the video to see if it actually fell through because I think it did, it fell through. So we wasted like three servings for nothing. Well, I mean, I could serve the soup again. I could like just cook the soup again tomorrow and not waste all these things here. Oh, but that's, uh, that's a, yeah, that's a real big problem, all right? I'm pretty sure that was a bowl here or like a big pot over here and then turned over, let that thing topple into here. I think it's pretty much like what happened in the pits area. Yeah, the pits area. You know, like when you put the, the, the equipment on the floor and then you put another one that the equipment... Or well, the pizza disappears, but the equipment was there, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, or both disappeared. Anyways, yeah, so if you put them on the floor, they sort of disappear. There's one here, though. I don't know why this plate is here. Kind of strange. Why was it there? Well, that was before. Okay, let's end the game. No, no, not like that. Not the menu. Gear up. Haha. <laughs> okay, we got everything done. Too cold and whatnot. Whatever. Yeah. There are definitely fewer rats. Finally, I can send technicians to check the installation. I hope it will be possible to eliminate the source of the problem. Take this silencer as a reward. It will come in handy if you have problems with mutants again in the future. I will join the repair team to investigate this matter myself. Prepared provisions should be enough for us on the way. The rats have been thinned out. The expedition also has provisions for the trip. Dr. Mill has joined the expedition to take a look at the problem personally. We got weapon upgrade, we got some more recipes, and yeah, that's it. Corporal Zoe Glaze. There is no time to waste. We need to act fast. Oh, you don't know who I am. My name is Corporal Zoe Glaze. I'm working with Dr. Mill. The expedition that Dr. Mill was with discovered that the water filtering system had been deliberately damaged by someone. But after Dr. Mill broadcast the message to command, he was charged with treason and arrested immediately by a squad that was coincidentally in the area. I have a bad feeling about this. We have to act fast. Command is organizing a Thanksgiving dinner soon. Prepare at least three meals using the recipes received from Dr. Mill. The medical team will prepare truth serum and add them to your dishes. Maybe we can learn what's really going on and fix this mess before it's too late. Sabotage! The water filtering system was damaged by humans, not rats. However, when Dr. Mill reported the results of his investigation to command, he was charged with treason and poisoning the residents. The behavior of command is extremely suspicious. Dr. Mill's colleagues want to get to the bottom of this and get some answers. I have to prepare three dishes from the military base recipes and then truth serum will be added to them. Requirements military base for the origin of the recipe and then minimum stars four. Unique dishes three. Rewards screen. Ah, okay. And we can accept this one. We'll give it a try. Why not? At most fail it. I mean like three days. We don't have to finish that. Oh, okay, yeah, white beans, definitely get more. And then vulture meat, uh, that's fine. Salty butter. Yeah, there's a chance that we need to use like a full bottle, so let's get more of those that are not in good quantity. Some of these oil thing, definitely not one full bottle, but some of those others. Like soy sauce, definitely not, but sourdough, maybe. Hey, hang on. Truth serum is not from us, right? We don't have the truth serum. We can't add it. 
No, we don't have it. Yeah, we don't have it. Oh, we lost one, so let's get one more. I mean, you know what? Let's get a few more. Chances are that we're gonna lose them again. <laughs> yeah. We're probably gonna lose them again. And, oh, this is really important though. So we should buy one of these each. Because we might lose them too. Pipette, we have two. That's fine. Yeah, okay. Timers, we have some. That's okay. Next, end the day. Package ready for pickup. So we'll end the day after picking up the package. What? 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 Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's put this here. Is that all? I don't know. Okay, the ladle can be... You know what? The ladle can be in here too. Because I don't think another pot can fit in there. Come on. Oh my goodness, really. What else do we have? Oh, baking tray. Did I not take it out from the previous purchase? Maybe. That's it. This episode, we had a pot of ready cooked food fall through the stove again, even though it didn't really lead to a lot of problems because we were able to complete the quest and serve the dishes, but it's still a very, very bad experience right there because it shouldn't have disappeared. My guess is it was like the pizzeria as mentioned. So you have a pizza on the floor, you pick up another pizza, that one that's on the floor disappears or maybe any surface. I can't remember the details, but it looked like that happened here too. So in this episode, we helped reduce the rat population to five, and then we also cooked a dish for Dr. Mills. Hey, not only that, we had a vegetarian pea soup. It's like the name is vegetarian pea soup. We submitted it for the quest for a vegetarian dish, and it did not fulfill the requirement of it being a vegetarian dish. This is a design gap. It is a vegetarian dish, the ingredients are implied to be vegetarian because otherwise this dish wouldn't be a vegetarian dish, or rather wouldn't be named as such. So why wouldn't it fulfill the requirements? So do take note, it's better to not accept this quest at all, just avoid it. Unfortunately, that's the best course of action. In the next day, we need to save Dr. Mills, and we need to prepare food, but we don't have the truth serum. They'll add it, so we just need to prepare the food. Thank you so much for watching. That's all I have for now. Have a nice day.